first took my Painterly Paint Pot by MAC and I applied that as a primer all over the eye. Immediately on top of that, I took my NYX Jumbo Pencil in Milk and I only applied that to the lid area. Just want to make sure it's blended out so that anything you put on top doesn't crease. For this look today, I'll be using my Wet n Wild Venice Vixen Color Icon Palette. It's one of their newer ones. Starting off with that crease shade, the really, really bright royal blue is so gorgeous. It's like the prettiest blue I've ever seen. I'm taking a MAC 242 brush. I'm packing this all over the lid area. I'm gonna go ahead and my buffer shade. For that, I'm taking the brow bone color right here. And I'll be using Sedona Lace EB13. For the outer V, I'm taking this definer shade in the middle. It's like a dark blue green. It's really gorgeous. It kind of serves kind of like a deepen or a darkening color to create more depth. I'm taking that with the Coastal Scents BRC SOE brush. I'm going back in with the brow bone shade for the buffer color. I'm going back on the lid to fix that blue. For the brow highlight, I'm taking a color from MAC this is called Blanc Type. It's a matte ivory. For that, I'm using a MAC 227. This is going to help pull all the colors down so that it doesn't go too high. I'm now taking my Milani Eye Tech Bold Liquid Eyeliner for the top. For the lower lash line, I'm taking my MAC Sense of Style Cold Power and also for the waterline. I'm setting that with that bright blue crease shade right here and I'm using that same 242 I used earlier to do that. I'm using my Miss Manga Mascara from L'Oreal. I'm also going to go ahead and clean up the bottom with my Cover FX Cream Concealer. This is in Golden Medium. With the Sedona Lace 773. For lashes, I'm taking the number 46s from my local beauty supply store. They look like this. You probably can't see because it's really dark on that side. I apologize for that. Once I'm done, I'll return and show you the rest of the face. I'm gonna go ahead and apply my foundation while I wait on my lash band to set using the NARS Sugar Golden Gaddies. Using the MAC 130 brush. blush I'm taking the Milani Big Blush and Bella Rosa with a Sedona Lace FB05. You definitely don't have to do bright pink but I feel with blues I always do bright pink so I'm gonna do Electric Fuchsia Maybelline Vivid's Color Sensational Lipstick. My lips look really dry. That's it for the look. I really hope you enjoyed it. I'll zoom in one final time so you can see the whole thing. These are the eyes. Our eyes. My face. And my bold fuchsia lips. Pictures of the final look will be in my blog. If you're interested in a full outfit of the day, please check the info box. I'll have a link for you. And... Also in the outfit, I will have weave in my hair. I do not have weave right now. This is actually my real hair, which doesn't look too um, too great because I didn't fly around it yet. I just blew, I just blew it out, blow dried it straight. Yeah. I will talk to all of you soon. Thanks for watching. Today, I was inspired by the colors in my kimono to pull this tutorial together. 
I did use yellow, orange, green, and beige, or like a golden lid. Very, very light. Not too dramatic. I did do the untypical, is that a word? I did the untypical blush color. I did yellow blush, 